Howler, also known as the Screamer. Like all other special infected, a Howler transforms from a viral. And just like all of the infected whose transformation into viral was derailed by a sudden dose of chemical, Howler is actually born in the same way. Basically, these chemicals attacked the victim's larynx and lungs. Howlers were created. It's because of them that the streets of the city are so dangerous. They won't attack you outright, but if one of them spots a human, the toxic substance in their chest will begin to boil, forcing them to emit an unearthly scream that will call other monsters from the surrounding area. You can easily spot a hauler by looking at his split jaw or by his pulsating yellow growth on the hauler's torso that makes him stand out from the ordinary viral. And hauler is more like a passive zombie. He doesn't fight. He's more like an alarm for the other zombies. Hauler is like, it's lunchtime and I've got a human, so he starts screaming and then Papa Volatile comes running. You know some crazy things about Holler? He would sometimes stand on his toes to see the surrounding better and to spot a human. He actually works like a recon. Did you know Holler still has some humanity left in him? He gets scared and really wants to scream but the virus has attacked his lungs and vocal cords and screaming would actually hurt him so he's helpless. Many infected zombies know that they have turned and they try to control themselves, but they're too weak and the virus actually takes over. Sometimes you would hear them cry for help and that's because the human inside them is not dead. According to Teclan, they're not walking dead. They're people who are infected by the virus and are being controlled by it. So yes, the human inside is still alive. Seriously, this can be a separate video on its own. Also, these infected people are helpless and angry. They can't fight the virus, so all they do is, you know, they get mad and all these aggression get built up and when they see a human, all these aggression gets released. It usually happens when they face an opponent and in that case, it will be us. In short, a hauler is basically a screamer. So guys, that was everything we know about hauler. Also, I would suggest you to take down hauler using stealth. That's the best way you can get him. Because, you know, you don't want him to bring down an army on you because he would scream on top of his lungs. And trust me, Papa Volatile doesn't like noise, so he will come after you. So if you want to be safe, then like this video and subscribe to my channel for more Dying Light Day videos. And the next zombie we're going to talk about is... Papa Volatile. So till then, stay safe and stay human.